one of the most popular musicians on the planet. Millions of albums sold, countless awards. But tonight, Bad Bunny is here to fight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Vega Baja, Puerto Rico. Weighing in at 160 pounds, Bad Bunny. Not only can he surprise you in the ring, he's actually earned a few accolades in WWE. Yeah, he held the 24-7 championship for a month and was the youngest champion in that title's history. That's a million times longer than both of you held it. At least I beat Corey to win it. From his music to his matches, you can tell Bad Bunny has a ton of passion for WWE. True, but can that passion translate to a win? Better get ready. And his opponent, accompanied by GF from New York, weighing in at 219 pounds, the men's action champion, B. You know, this person takes some pride in their work, but who could blame them? Few are as gifted in the ring as this performer. Wow, you are laying it on thick, Saxton. Don't worry, I'm sure they'll hear you when they watch this match ten times before bed tonight. The champ ready to get this non-title match started here. You know, Cole, I question if the champ even deserves this title. If he's so good, why not put it on the line for every match? I think he's just staying ring ready, Corey, making sure he doesn't rest on his laurels, staying prepared for when there's a big fight to be had. But across the ring is one of the biggest names on the planet, Bad Bunny. Hard to believe this guy finds time to get in the ring between recording sessions and tour dates. His dedication to performing for the fans is truly exceptional. Well, it seems like anything Bad Bunny does, he does at an incredibly high level. So when he decided to step in the ring, he took it very seriously and turned himself into someone who could hang with the... You know what here, Corey? The colossal clutch. It sits in. I think we're just moments away from... Slipped right underneath, and just like that, he's out of the hold. What's the worst mistake you could possibly make tangling with Bad Bunny in the ring? I think that would have to be mistaking him for a tourist, Cole. Bad Bunny may be a platinum-selling recording artist, but he's also a very serious in-ring competitor. This isn't just a side hustle for him, so you have to treat him like you would any other top-tier superstar here in WWE. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. Wrenching the arm. Driven all the way down for a European heartbreaker. Beautiful takedown into the Achilles lock. Uh, he's in complete control. All the pressure on the left knee. He's trying to fight it. He's trying to break out and does it. Laser precision with this superstar's feet. Things are changing. Talk about digging deep to give yourself an opportunity to win. Point of the elbow finds the mark. Fighting back with the counter. He's getting a huge boost right now from all those. Not allowing that to go on any longer. Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. Knee right to the gut. That hit might have Bad Bunny thinking about leaving the ring and going back on tour. Uh, head scissors. Round and round we go. He hits the head scissors. And Bad Bunny caught by surprise. He has been here before and he knows what he needs to do. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. He's looking completely lost as he finds his footing. Oh, look out. Diving brain chop. Bad Bunny turns it around. Front 
face lock applied. Hoist it up. Sit out, broke it. This could be it. Cover for the win. No, he gets the shoulder up. I didn't think we'd see a kick out there. Bad Bunny setting up something big. What the heck? Bunny Destroyer? Did Bad Bunny just close this out? Is it enough? The cover! Got him, and Bad Bunny is your winner. Now let's look back at that amazing action.